School bus driver shortages and pay issues are affecting many local school districts. Last month, we saw a sick out in Cumberland County. In Chapel Hill, Carborough City Schools, a COVID outbreak among drivers forced several route cancellations. And tonight, Wake County Schools is tackling the issue. WRAL's Aaron Thomas joins us live with the discussion plan for tonight's meeting. Aaron. Elena, those board members are meeting right now as we speak. They say that they have a lot of work cut out for them when it comes to addressing these unfilled positions across the district. They are looking at uh, supplementing some salaries with bonuses and trying to recruit new talent with two upcoming job fairs. Children in the state's largest school district are not getting to and from school on time due to the ongoing bus driver shortage. Numbers obtained by WREL show the shortage is getting worse in Wake County schools. At last check, 285 bus driver positions remain unfilled. That's more than 10% higher than a year ago. Wake County Schools currently has an ongoing effort to recruit new drivers with a $1,200 bonus. Districts try to supplement salaries when they can with bonuses, but funding for state-funded employees like teachers comes from the state. The director of recruitment for Wake Schools shared how school leaders are going up against challenges to find new employees and keep current ones. We're looking at all surrounding uh, school systems and uh, doing comparisons Comparisons. We're looking and seeing what is actually working. Uh, is that pay bump going to actually make a difference in getting uh, the talent in the door? And those two upcoming job fairs I was talking about, you have one that's going to be on March 25th here on the Crossroads campus in Cary. That's specifically for teachers interested in working on at the schools uh, with high needs. Then you have one that's next month, April 15th. All schools are invited. That will be taking place at Nightdale High School. Lena. Aaron Thomas reporting live for us in Wake County. Thank you.